What's up everybody? This is Harry and this is part two of my Air Crete journey. So in this part I want to talk about this. This is the commercial grade foam machine that I bought uh, last year. I bought this because the Green Dragon wasn't working. I was wasting a lot of time and I wanted to get this stuff built. I needed to get this Air Crete figured out and I thought, hey, I need to get the machine the pros are using, right? Well, no, not really. Uh, it does work good. Here, um, this machine, the way it works is you have your foaming agent, which is a concentrate, goes into uh, this container here. Then you have your um, air pressure here. This is your air pressure gauge. This knob controls the air pressure. You have uh, your water, uh, your water, and your foaming agent that's... Uh, gets pumped through these hoses and everything unites at this end here your air pressure your water and your foaming agent all get mixed into here so this one which is big pushes out a lot of foam and so here this is the uh, controlling unit for here for this unit so you have your manual mode oops time mode water percentage, foam ratio. So you could control how much water or how much foam goes through the unit. And so this unit came with a computer online where you input uh, how much cement you're using and it tells you what the ratios should be, you know, for, for getting different uh, compressive strength aircrete. So as soon as you put foam in cement, you're making aircrete. So, anyway, let me show you how this machine works. It's really cool. And, um, and why not? So you can check this out. Okay, so I'm going to turn the unit on. You see, the foam comes out strong. having too much fun now. So this machine's great. That's great because um, if you're doing large jobs uh, and you need to make a lot of aircrete, this is perfect because you don't want to mess around with some small unit it's going to take you forever to get the uh, you know, like a cement truck fill. So if you're doing a large slab of aircrete, or even if you're just doing, you know, you're doing aircrete walls, and you have a lot of cement to do, that's what you want. Your cement truck will come, you put that hose in it, and there's a timer, you know. Uh, with the computer, you can calculate how long you leave the foam machine on, pumping foam into the cement truck to get whatever compressive strength cement you're looking to get um, so anyway I just wanted to share that uh, this machine I actually um, the other big thing with this unit is the foaming agent is very expensive I think I paid 250 for five gallon of the uh, of that of the uh, foaming agent which was very expensive but since then I've tested this machine out with other foaming agents um, and why not and it does work so I don't necessarily have to use the really expensive one which by the way uh, doesn't hold up as well as the Drexel uh, in the foam test I, I've done a foam test off camera where I tested the foam 
uh, put out by the foaming agent for this commercial grade and the foam that I made with the uh, green dragon wand using Drexel and uh, the Drexel one outlasted it the bubbles collapsed and why not so it uh for commercial grade it's it's not necessary that's the thing I learned very important is I spent a lot of money for that machine and it's great if you're doing a lot of cement work but if you're not the smaller green dragon or the mini dragon is is all you really need for most of your home projects you're gonna do and why not so anyway that's it for this video my next video I'm gonna be doing a another phone test and so that's coming soon and so anyway I just wanted to also thank all my viewers uh, I want to ask that you hit the like button and subscribe and this summer I got a lot of cool videos coming out I'll be building my uh, Aircrete dome soon maybe next weekend or the following weekend we're just trying to get the schedules worked out but it's going to be a monolithic Aircrete pour, pour using the two air forms so anyway that's coming soon anyway peace out everyone catch you later